Hey girl, welcome back to the vlog. Today's Sunday, November 6th, I believe. I just ordered some Dunkin' from DoorDash and we're gonna have some Dunkin' for breakfast. It's like 10.30 probably right now, so it's like a little late breakfast. But um, I have some editing to do today. I need to clean. I just need to get ready for the week, basically. I did a little bit of makeup today because I wanted to like feel good, look good. <laughs> But yeah, I need to put on something on my lips. But yeah, um, so I wanted to say hey to you guys. If you're new here, my name is Jasmine. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. It's a new week. We're excited. They didn't show us the full episode. They only showed the half. I got a croissant with um, sausage and cheese. I don't really eat eggs, so I got. Welcome to the I actually need to edit um, today's vlog, today's weekly vlog, so I'm going to work on that. I think I have like two hours of footage, so it's going to take me quite a while to edit, which I should have started yesterday, but I had a headache, and I actually feel a headache coming on again today, so um, I don't know what's causing it, but yesterday I waited like quite a while before I, take in, before I took an Advil. Today I'm just going to take one in about five minutes or so because I don't really want to have to deal with this headache all day so yeah let's get to work y'all because I got some work to do just just my outfit you guys so I worked yesterday all day cleaning out my garage because I wanted to build a gem in there so we could use it in the winter and stuff I'm also going to switch out the wax that's in here because I feel like it's not scented anymore so what I've been what I've been doing is using these cotton balls to soak up the wax that's in here. So, yeah, let's do that. Yeah, so they basically just soak everything up and then I'm going to add the new wax melts. I'm going to do vanilla cinnamon today. Actually, this is what I was burning, vanilla bourbon. So I'm going to do cinnamon on it. I usually do too. This one I got at at home. The other one I got at Target. So yesterday I cleared out this part of the garage, you guys, and I'm gonna bring in my Peloton so we can have like a little workout area. So I'm actually gonna move this. We're here. Okay. Which way you want it to face, Jazz? I think. Uh, the wall. I don't That's want this. Yeah, I want the screen to be secured. Right. Which way you want to? Here, let me go over here. How does that look towards me? Yeah. Right, I think. Work out. Close. You did a workout, you could turn like this. Right, and stand oh, right wow. here. You could be like, oh, because you could do stuff in there too. Yeah, oh, you have oh, like. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> excuse me. So I just got done editing. Um, well, kind of. I just got done editing like all the, like I just got done editing all the talking stuff in the vlog. Right now, I am putting the music to the background so I'm adding the background music and then I'm going to just see if there's any areas that I, need, that I need to bring up levels of the audio like if I'm not talking and I'm like cooking or doing something like that so I'm gonna do that once I'm done doing that I think there's nothing else I need to like do in this vlog I ordered an intro for vlogmas I'm so excited so my intro is gonna be made um so so excited i feel like i've said this before but i really love the holiday season i love the spirit i love the smells i love everything about it so vlogmas to me is kind of like just sharing holiday stuff with you guys also um i'm trying to plan out my gym so my home gym i'm trying to think of things i can put in there to like just make it look cool i think i'm gonna paint it i've been going back and forth with myself whether i wanted to paint it or not or like to do anything to the walls but the more I think about it, the more I'm kind of like, you know what? I should just paint it, throw some paint on there, and just, like, just that section. Um, so it could look refreshed and updated. I also want to um, make it feel like a space that I want to be in. So I'm going to do that. And I also want to get a basket to store more things, like my bands and stuff like that. I want to get a little basket. I think I'm going to... I used to have a little skin fridge for my face products that I felt like was it was so cool at one point but honestly it kind of like it became inconvenient if I had maybe a bathroom vanity that I could put it on and hide it it would be nice but I just didn't like the way it looked 
I think I'm going to use that to store a couple of drinks. Like maybe I could put my Celsius or my Alani New drink in there. If they fit, I'm going to check. So I need to go find that fridge. I think it's in my closet, which has my closet, like where I keep my um, extra makeup. I keep like filming equipment and like YouTube stuff content creator stuff it's a hot mess so i think it's in that closet though i need to tackle that and really go through stuff anyways let me finish this real quick and i'll talk to y'all a little bit later this is the face of someone who just got done editing ah. <laughs> it's always the best feeling when i hit export on my computer and i'm done editing i need to actually write something on my list for vlogmas before i forget i need to get a new hard drive because one thing that happens, one thing that happens when you're filming a lot of videos that are long or just a lot in general, your hard drive gets full uh, and it always catches me off guard. So I need to get a blank brand new one so that I don't run into that issue. Just uploaded my video. It's currently going through the YouTube checks to let me know whether or not there's any copyright stuff. There's nothing because I didn't use any soundcloud music so we should be good but it should go through pretty quickly i'm gonna i found a fridge while you guys weren't looking i went into that closet and i got the fridge yeah this is the inside and i still had sheet mask in here i need to throw these all out that is crazy i can take this shelf out and i think it's perfect yeah so once i take the shelf out i can definitely fit maybe four alani news or even for celsius uh drinks in here and i think i can just keep this in the garage hey you guys so i'm over here planning out november's second week this is my first week i did fragrance picks the forest try on and a vlog so i'm planning out week two which is going to be this coming up this week coming up um i like to do this ahead of time usually but this month i've been kind of because I, I think last month was so busy that I didn't get a chance to plan November properly. So I'm working on this coming week right now for YouTube. And I'm going to do TikTok. And we're going to watch the game. Right, so we just got our groceries. This is, we did instant cart tonight so that way we didn't have to go out. We just did instant cart from Stop and Shop. Oh, I was gonna tell you, can I watch? Quick grocery haul from uh, instant cart. We got some seltzer. We got some school snacks. So some of these crackers, some uh, Oreos, fruit snacks, juices, Capri Sun and Juicy Juice some tacos for taco tuesday we, we got the meat for this but i already put it in the fridge so we got that as well got some pretzels got some bread i also got some turkey burgers but i put those in the fridge as well um got some grapes some pringles for snacks for school and then some orange juice um so yeah that's pretty much it we had most we didn't really need too many things just the stuff for the week hello good morning today is monday morning i just dropped cali off at school i'm heading to starbucks i'm heading to starbucks i actually want to try a holiday drink today i also really really want to find that gold starbucks cup you guys it looks so pretty like i really need it in my life a couple days ago i had gone to starbucks in target and they had the pink one but I really want the gold one. Like the gold one, ooh, mm. Gold just really does something for me, y'all. I really love gold, so. And I want the short ones. I find that I use them more often because they just make more sense. Like I never have, I don't typically drink water out of those. Usually I'm making iced coffee at home and I'm not making that much iced coffee. So I really, really want a small gold one. And also they're better for storage. It's just better in general. So and also a holiday drink i'm not sure which one i'm gonna get yet yeah i'm gonna go to starbucks first and then if i don't find the cups there then i'll check uh target i do have a bunch of stuff in the back i'm sure you can see i need to take to goodwill because i cleaned out like a lot of um things we weren't using and stuff in the garage so taking that stuff to goodwill like i said it's monday so how are you guys doing i hope you guys are having an amazing week comment below like what you got going on like you know what's up share uh, an achievement in the comments so we can all congratulate you 
and I think it's also motivating to see like what other people are doing and take it as motivation you know don't take it as like why them not me take it as motivation for what you can do okay so if you got anything you want to share in the comments feel free to share it below so we can say congratulations also today my mom's kitchen upstairs is getting demolished the demolishers are probably there right now i think they were coming in um as i was leaving i don't know how long it's gonna last they said dem demolition day so i'm assuming it's just today hopefully it's just one day though but even if it's one day they still need to do the build all the construction and stuff so i don't know how long that's gonna take um because i know there's like a floor that needs to be done and then you know it's it's not gonna be one day it's probably gonna i hope it's just i just hope it's not gonna take the whole month because i just really hope it doesn't take the whole month since y'all know i work from home i can see what cups they got they got red i don't see the gold i see pink uh, i really hope when i get close to okay i just took a peek in the window at starbucks and i don't see gold i see the pink cup and a red cup Maybe when I get inside, I'll find a gold one, but uh, right now it's looking like there's no gold. But let's go investigate. Got my first holiday drink, you guys. This is the cup that I got. This is the cup, you guys. The cup is so cute. I got a caramel brulee latte. How cute is this cup? Okay, so I'm gonna, this is hot, so I'm gonna have it just sit. Um, so it gets cooler, but we're gonna go to Target. They didn't have, they didn't have the cups in there. They didn't even have the pink one. I thought I said a pink one, but it was like red. It's, I don't know. But we're gonna go to Target, see what we find, and hopefully they have it. If not, we'll keep looking. <laughs> just got to Goodwill. Just uh, left Goodwill. Just dropped everything off. I have a couple bags in the back that I'm gonna put in the drop boxes. Because I know with the Dropbox, I believe they just give them to people. Um, it's free, I think. Goodwill, you know, they do sell the stuff, I believe. I'm not sure. I, I've, I've heard that. I've heard that at least. I'm not sure if I'm, you know, quoting that correctly. So I do want to put some stuff in the Dropbox. That way it goes out for free. Maybe that only applies to certain bins because there's literally a sign on that bin that says everything in here will be sold. So, I don't know. I thought the bins were free. So, I don't know. I did. I put this stuff in already. So, oh crap. I didn't close the trunk properly. I'll just close it when I get to Target. Um, <laughs> the Target's right here. Don't worry. We are at Target. Um, I'm going to go look for that cup. Anything. I might look around and see the Christmas stuff, but I don't know if I need anything in here. I want a couple other things, but they are not from Target, uh, and I'm still trying to decide if I want to get them or not. Okay, so let us go to Target. Came from Target, and look what I found. This is the gold mini. I was so excited, you guys. They had both the mini and the big in both the gold and the pink. So I decided to get this. So this is what it looks like. Oh my gosh. So cute, you guys. Like, what the heck? So cute. What? It's in the 70s today, which is crazy. Like, it's very questionable. <laughs> but it's like, uh, it feels nice. I don't know. I mean, I know it's not a good thing, but i'm heading back home i actually meant to stop at a beauty supply store oh my gosh what the heck so you guys this right so i'm back home and this is my tumbler i'm so excited i know i already showed you guys in the car but i am so excited to have this tumbler it's so cute 
love the gold color this is definitely my favorite one i've ever gotten it's funny because i actually took two of these to goodwill earlier today because they were the taller ones and like i said earlier briefly like i feel like the taller ones don't always work for me because i don't really use them i'm just gonna be like you got another tumbler i'm not sure if i showed you guys this one that i've been using this is the stanley cup and it's definitely really really popular right now but i've been really obsessed with this because i fill it up with water and i just take it around all day and i have a hydro flask but i feel like this is just better because it has the handle and i could carry it around it's huge it stays cool all day long or hot whatever you put in there but i usually do like ice water and yeah, I've been really loving this for like carrying around my water. The other cup, I'll, I'll probably, I'll use the other one for coffee and tea or anything else really. But yeah, I love this cup. Also, I've been kind of feeling like not myself lately. Like just because I've been like switching uh, birth control is growing crazy basically. So I just decided to do like a reset tonight, like a personal reset. Let me show you guys what they did. So this is what it's looking like. Um, everything's gone. Um, yeah, this is it. The floor is gonna be changed as well. This is the other side. Uh, this is these are the old appliances that are getting taken out. Um, this is also gonna get taken out. I'm gonna go get Callie soon. Hey guys, good morning. So I just got finished with parent teacher conferences for Cali. Um, I have clays tomorrow. But yeah, I'm I'm about to go to Target. I really wanted to try to get one of the um little pancake waffle maker thing. I really want to see I want to check to see if they have it at another Target. I told you guys in my last vlog that I wanted um either like a Christmas tree or like a like another one to add to my one that I have right now. I'll also get coffee and then I will grab something for the kids to eat. So I'm gonna go do that now. I also need to go to the gas station. Hit me back all you get the message. So I just wanna give you guys a quick birth control update since I've been talking about it for about, I don't know, like a month or so. Um, so I've been off the pill for a week, you guys, and I feel so much better. I didn't realize, like, I think I want to do a whole separate video on this, but like, I didn't realize how much, um, I was being affected by the birth control in general. So, um, anyways, I stopped the pill because I mentioned to you guys, like, it was causing a lot of, like, bloating, digestive issues i was having headaches i was feeling moody and just down it was really affecting me and i noticed it because it was very like drastic like it was way different than how i typically felt and um i i, I was like i can't do this myself like this is crazy so i ended up stopping and also there was a bunch of other stuff that was going on with it and um i have it written down so maybe i'll share it in a different video but I have feel I feel so much better. Like I would wake up and just be bloated off of just brushing my teeth. I had been on the IUD for uh, six years, five, six years, I think. Um, one of those numbers. <laughs> and honestly, I experienced some of these things as well, but it was very gradual and I didn't notice it was coming from the IUD so one thing I did notice from the IUD was back pain like I was getting back pain and I actually had a patient who told me when I was working at my nursing job I had a patient who told me that she had back pain from her IUD and she had to take it out and when she told me that that's when I kind of realized that's what was causing my back pain because I had got I had gotten back pain out of nowhere like and I yeah, I had an epidural with clay, which was like uh, 10, 11 years ago. 10 years ago, I had an epidural with clay, but I never had back pain. I didn't have epidural with Callie. Um, I just delivered. And then the back pain didn't start until I started my IUD, but I never put two and two together until that patient told me that. Taking it out, I have not had that pain, y'all. Like, it has not 
been here. This is not to like scare anybody or to like make anyone think any certain way about um, any birth control because everybody is different. Like some people have no symptoms. Some people have the most extreme symptoms, way worse than what I experienced. So I'm not trying to, you know, tell anyone anything or make a decision and try to like uh, sway your decision or anything like that. I'm just saying my experience because I noticed a lot of people who went through things and didn't really realize that's what was causing it or they were like kind of like scared to say anything. I have stumbled. I have binge watched so many videos in the past few weeks just on that topic. I have a lot of positives too like it did its job. Um, and really that's the only positive because nothing else came out of it but the fact that it did its job um, I'm gonna grab my coffee and my hopefully I find that waffle maker that I was looking for so I can add it to my little collection and then we will be on our way because I have no business spending extra excess time in Target today Hey y'all, it's a lot later. It's 8.08 right now at night. I haven't vlogged since earlier, but I'll show you guys what I got at Target. We had an electrician working upstairs, so it was kind of noisy throughout the day, and also he needed help with certain things, and um, I had to kind of like help him. So let me show y'all what I got at Target. Here's the bag. I literally did not even vlog after leaving Target, but I only got one thing which I'm happy and proud of myself. I picked up this little christmas tree um dash maker waffle maker i picked up another one last week i honestly forgot what i got i think it was a snowman was it a snowman do you guys remember because <laughs> i don't so i wanted to get at least two so i picked up these two and i really think they're cute kids always love when i make those little waffles that one today and that's really all i went to target for i also wanted to look at what they have for bathroom and just get kind of an idea and then for the kitchen as well i did take a little peek I was helping out the guy i actually uploaded a video that i did with Dalva. This is the product that I shared in that video and I really love it. It's really, really nice. Anyways, y'all, I need to get my kids ready for bed. It's 8 15. And Johnny and I are watching a show right now. We're watching um from scratch. We're on episode three. We're being very adult about it and only watching one episode a night. So it's taking us longer than usual, but it's <laughs> healthier. <laughs> so we're in episode three and so far it's really good, but like we're like so nervous. We both are like, we can feel like something's gonna happen because it just seems like, you know, you know when something's gonna happen in a show, like it's something's gonna happen, you know? So we're just waiting to see what that thing is. Um, yeah, so I'll let y'all know my thoughts <laughs> once we're done. Probably by the end of this week, we should be done. So I'll let you guys know what I think of the whole show. I have a couple PR packages that I just got in today. So I'm going to show you guys what's... I'm going to show you guys what I got. This first one is from Laura Mercier. Actually, this is more of the flyer where it has like all the different products. Okay. Ooh, this looks fun. So this is translucent setting powder and puff. I love the color. This is translucent. It does have like a limited um it does have a limited edition packaging as you can see here I also sent this little package of their caviar sticks and these are really great for eyeliners eyeshadow so it has three um so these these are the three shades that this one came with and then this is their cheek to cheek tinted moisturizer blush duo oh these are the blush um products they're really good so this is what that looks like and this is the front package mercy's package then i also got a pr package from Verst. i've actually never gotten a package from them before sorry my kids and johnny are talking but um why is everyone's voice so much louder than mine like i hate that anyways um so this says it's so it looks like this is like their glowing collection they're Okay, so this is, is this the, 
this is the package happy holidays from team burst and then this one comes with the brightening gift set Hey you guys, it's Wednesday morning. Um, it's like 11 o'clock right now. I'm gonna start working on my laptop. Also, we have some workers here today as well. So it's probably gonna get a little noisy. So I don't know how much vlogging I'll be doing, but um, yeah, just wanted to say hello, good morning. Hey you guys, it's Thursday night and I'm getting ready to go to the movies. Johnny and I are gonna go watch uh, Wakanda the second movie so i'm just gonna just washing my face i'm not doing makeup tonight i'm just washing my face i'm just gonna do skincare i just got my little light all right so i'm pretty much doing skincare i just washed my face i'm gonna do like hydration i guess um i actually wanted to try this emulsion in reach from la Citan. they sent this over and it's a I'm not sure what exactly it is. I'm not gonna use it tonight. I'm gonna use something that I know what it is. <laughs> I'm just gonna use this. This is like an essence, basically. Don't mind my nails, you guys. Ugh. So today was a day because I was supposed to film today, but my nails look so crazy. I tried to get a nail appointment, but um, I couldn't because she was bugged and I waited last minute. So I took it upon myself to try to do my nails myself. And I also decided in the midst of it all that I was going to try doing press-ons because I just feel like it's a lot more convenient to me. I really, honestly, like I've never been a fan of press-ons. Um, granted, the last time I tried press-ons, they were not cool. That was like 20 years ago, probably. And they were not, maybe 10 years ago. And, you know, they were not the quality that they are now. So I haven't tried press-ons since it became so much better and you know popular so i'm gonna give them a try because i actually have quite a few because um i've gotten some sense over to me so i wanted to try press on for a little bit see how i like it um but first i have to get rid of my acrylics i did file them down a bit but i need to like get rid of them somehow so i'm probably gonna get them soaked off i need to get acetone anyways that was my essence i'm gonna do my summer fridays dream oasis So that's the Dream Oasis. It adds a ton of hydration. I really love it. Um, and then I'm going to do maybe like an oil or something like that. Get around my cabinet to see what oil. Actually, I've been really enjoying the Indy Lee products. So I'm going to use their... I'm going to use... Oh, I forgot to use my little cocky tan. It's okay though. I did use a different essence. But I'm going to use their Squalene Facial Oil, which is this one here. All right, so I'm just going to... Brush my brows with no product, just like this spoolie thing. gonna pull some hair out and then I'm gonna just do edge control. It's not edge control. I'm gonna wear a sweater like a crew neck probably. I'm gonna go pick that out and then I'm wearing leggings right now just black leggings. That's what I'm gonna wear and then I'll pick out a fragrance. <laughs> fragrance. A perfume. It's 24 hours later and I'm in the same exact spot that I was in yesterday when I turned the camera on. So not judge me but um yeah getting ready once again so johnny and i are going on basically like a double date with johnny's sister she's our age so we're gonna go out with her so we're going on a double date with her to the city i'm just gonna put on fancy lipstick and i don't know what color this is what color is this i am not sure oh this is major magnet so yeah i'm gonna put this color um so we saw Black Panther yesterday and it was really good. 
so we saw black panther yesterday uh wakanda too it was really good we definitely enjoyed it we feel like it's a must see it's really really good if you like black panther one i feel like you're gonna like it as well but today we were at target um grabbing some stuff and we overheard two men saying how they didn't like it and we were like what like we were so confused like how did you not like it but they seemed like they were like ultra marvel fans so maybe i don't know maybe it didn't hit the way they they thought it would <laughs> we're not like super marvel fans obviously we love black panther and like some of the marvel movies but we're not like ultra fans of mag of um of marvel so maybe like you know if you're a super fan i don't know for my hair today i literally just put it back in a bun i have like a little little curl coming out here i want it to look like um like i didn't care which i literally didn't so that's kind of the vibe i was going for i'm not sure if i want to curl this piece with the curling iron and just make it like more of a curl i don't know but the thing is if i do that it's gonna be like up here and i feel like it looks better down here so mm, i'll do it let's do it i didn't put anything in my hair because tomorrow i want to blow it out um so far like right now my hair just has water <laughs> i didn't put any product in it because i want to blow it out tomorrow because um it's raining tonight like crazy because of the hurricane i think there's a hurricane like i want to say like south carolina so um because this like this it's raining really badly up here so it makes no sense to like do you know what i really should not do this and i forgot that's the whole reason why i didn't want to bother with doing anything with heat but i will add a little bit of this primer i actually really like this stuff you guys um a lot of you guys were complimenting my hair in a couple of my recent videos i think it's this it's literally this and the conditioner that goes with it so i'm gonna do my routine and show y'all what i did that time when i shampooed my hair the only thing that i used was that spray so i think this is kind of cute see it went up here but i think it's cute what do y'all think i'm just gonna go let's just go back to straight i think it looks better like this yeah mm -hmm. we're gonna keep it like this I meant to vlog today i meant to vlog all day long but it just did not happen um Early, I was like super tired from going out late, and we had to drop the kids off at their grandparents, um, like early in the morning. So, yeah, I was just tired. I was also supposed to film today, but it didn't happen. I was just like going through it. I'm gonna put some jewelry on, like bracelets and stuff, and I'm also gonna grab a like overcoat to go over this because I'm gonna put a jacket, like a trench coat or something over this it's not super cold today it's like 70s probably 60s 50s at night to iron this i just put it on to see what it would look like and we're in some black leggings maybe so let's go iron my shirt okay so i changed into this outfit basically just a short of black button down and then some jeans and then i'm wearing this bag i'm gonna throw in the jacket and some ooh, <laughs> and some black and some black booty booties like short boots ankle boots for shoes i think i'm going to just wear these because it's raining out um those are the ones i care about the least because <laughs> they're like, the cheapest i guess i'm in the garage so it looks kind of crazy but i'll show you guys the full outfit shoes For fragrance today, I'm wearing YSL Libre. I've been wearing that nonstop. I literally like cannot put it down. So that's what I'm wearing today for perfume. I forgot to spray my face. I'm gonna go spray my face real quick with the MAC um, Fix Plus. That stuff is really good. The pink and black bottle. I'll show y'all real quick. Let me show you guys because I have been really loving it. Okay, so this is the MAC spray that I'm talking about. I love it, it's so good. Also, this is the fragrance that I wore today. But yeah, I'm gonna spray this on. Let's go. 
Saturday and I'm getting ready for um for Cortica. Cortica is basically like a football game between the college um, Johnny and I went to. It's between Ithaca College where Johnny and I went and then and Cortland. So it happens every year obviously. <laughs> So it's like a and it's like their it's like their big rivalry. It's like a big rivalry game basically and it's pretty popular so they're having it in the Yankee Stadium this year. So this morning I just did the um, dry bar dryer back there because we need to find parking and we're probably going to like pregame and stuff. Um, how you doing? Can I get a, um, a medium caramel macchiato, please? Yes, please. And also... A tall caramel brulee latte. Tall caramel brulee latte. Caramel brulee latte. Hot, right? Yes. Okay. And a plain croissant. Are you and uh, can I get two plain croissants, please? So we just stopped at Starbucks because um, we want him to eat. I'm getting a caramel brulee latte to get a train, but it was... We couldn't figure out the parking, so we ended up just leaving and we're going to drive lower down. Um, we're still not sure if we're going to drive to the Astro Stadium or, or park somewhere else and then take an Uber. We're trying to decide because parking near the stadium is going to be crazy probably. So it probably like it's better or easier to take an Uber. Let's see. You guys, we tried taking the train. When we tried taking the train, the other team, like the whole train station, was their fans. Like, and they their colors are red, so it was just like red everywhere in the train station. Just mine. I think so. Yeah, I'm gonna have a good one. Good Cups. I think Starbucks made 25 cups this year. They young, but they treat me like an OG. And they want to the see on me, I swear these bitches nosy. Said he put some money on my head, I guess we gon' see. I won't put no money on this head, my niggas owe me. I gotta be single for a while, you can't control me. Who no those traits in a race, they can't hold me. And I show my face in a case, so you know it's me. Imitation is a flattery, it's just annoying me. And I'm too about it. And the dirt that they do, all the rain turn to red, and I grew up by it. Time for y'all to figure out what y'all gonna do about it. Big wheels keep rolling, rolling outside. 29, T5, Seaside. I've been losing friends and finding peace. 